Are you struggling to describe what it is that you do? And one of the reasons maybe you're struggling is that you're trying to integrate the variety of interests and passions and skills that you have into one statement. That is too much pressure and it's not even needed for your business. Let me tell you how making money works. This is how money is made. Okay, a, a potential customer or client, they see the offer, the product or service in front of them, and they go, this is what I want. All right, this is what I want. And do I like the person offering it? Do I like the brand? If I like the brand, I'll go check it out. I will really consider it. That's it. They don't go, gosh, this product? Well, let me go to the, the brand or person's about page, and only if I agree with their entire story and how they weave themselves into one niche, then I decide to buy from them. That's not how much of the money-making works. It's someone sees an Instagram ad or a YouTube ad or a Facebook ad, and it matches what they're looking for, what they've been thinking about. They like that brand or they've heard of that brand. Someone has told them about it. They go check it out. Like, oh, okay. I didn't know George offers this kind of thing. Well, I like George or I've heard of George, so I'll go seriously consider it. That's it. So maybe you should let go and relax on trying to weave together your infinite interests into one niche or one homepage or one intro statement. Your homepage simply can be, my name is George Cow, and I have these different interests. If you're interested in that, go here. If you're interested in this, go there. I'll give you another example of somebody who is very successful doing this. Gary Vaynerchuk. Some of you are watching this on Instagram. Some of you are watching this on YouTube. Some of you are watching this on Facebook, on LinkedIn, wherever. He is everywhere. And guess what? He has like 15 different interests and he talks about all of it. And those of us who follow Gary, we're not interested in everything he's interested in. I'm interested in maybe three out of 15 of his interests. I mean, he's interested in all kinds of things that I don't care about. He, he's interested in baseball cards. He sells wine, which I, I don't drink wine. I don't drink alcohol at all. Um, he sells sneakers. I don't care about sneakers. I have, I have terrible shoes. Uh, he's interested in, you know, parenting. I, I don't have kids, so it doesn't match, matter to me. So he's interested in lots of things that I don't care about. He talks about all those things I don't care about, but... What I like about him, I like his values. I like his values of generosity and service and authenticity. So I follow him for his values. And he talks about business too, which that's one of the few things he talks about that I'm interested in. So same thing with you. Why are you trying so hard to try to integrate everything into one when you can simply just be yourself? Choose freedom. Choose flexibility. And then when you make money, when you need to make money, when you're selling something, just sell that specific offer to specific audiences who care. And, and what you need to do is you need to optimize the description and the offer itself. That's true. You need to do that. But it doesn't have to be integrating your entire body of, uh, of work and your past you know, experiences and your future past. No, don't worry about all that. You, you, that, that's an intro statement. You can work on that for the rest of your life. Let it be a lifetime project to try to integrate because guess what? You keep evolving and it keeps changing anyway. So the integration of who you are, your homepage, your about page, your intro statement, your bio, just let it keep evolving for the rest of your life. It, it doesn't make you money. What makes you money is selling products and services that are specific to specific people as long as they like you, they like your values, they like your energy, they will consider it. And if it's a right fit for them, they'll buy it. That's it. And on that product page or service page, of course, you talk about the part of your life, the sliver of your life where you are qualified to offer that product or service. That's it. But you don't have to integrate everything. Just be specific with your offers and with your intro statement or with your homepage or with your bio just let it be a lifetime project. I don't stress myself. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what my integration is. I do all kinds of stuff. I like to talk about all kinds of different things, right? So relax. Don't worry about the integration. Don't worry about niching if you're struggling with it. Don't worry. Just let it go then and focus specifically on offers instead. I hope this is helpful. I'm Actually, tomorrow I'm teaching a, a whole class on how do you optimize specific offers. So if you're interested, you could take my class on that. But otherwise... I just hope you'll let it go. I hope this video provides you relief 
and that you'll be focusing on the right efforts, which is focusing on offers and letting the intro integration homepage about, let that stuff go. Seriously, it's not going to make you money. The offers make you money. Okay, so I hope this is helpful and I wish you well. Take care. I'll see you in the next video.